Welcome to the Dumfries Ice Bowl in Scotland. It is World Championship Division 2A action. There are 15 games at this tournament. It's going to be a fantastic few days. We start today at 1 o'clock. Romania against Korea. At 4.30, it is Croatia against Lithuania. And then at 8pm, it is GB against the Netherlands. It is a thrilling tournament for GB to be involved in. They have a chance of promotion and the gold medal and as I say 15 games over the next few days and it is the gold medal winners who will get promoted to Division 1B. That's the aim of all six teams in this tournament. Well GB are getting ready today. They've had a training session this morning as have most of the teams here for this tournament. I caught up with head coach Martin Grubb and asked him how everybody was feeling. Martin Grubb, head coach of GB under 18s. It's tournament day. We're finally here. How are you feeling? Yeah we feel good. Um been here since Thursday, played Korea Friday, which went really well for us. And I think since then, the boys have been desperate to play. So everybody's woke up in a good mood. We've had a good breakfast. We'll, we're going to skate this morning, and then we'll be ready to play in the Netherlands tonight. What can you realistically expect from this tournament? Um, I mean, obviously, like any tournament, I think everybody's first goal is to stay in the, in the group. But for us, we, we're looking to push for a medal. And I mean, obviously, I think everybody's dreams ultimately gold. I think we've got a group of players that are more than capable, so we need to stay consistent and stay focused. And yeah, definitely a medal is the minimum that we'll expect. This ring, Dumfries Ice Bowl, is where you coach with the Solway Sharks. How extra special is it for you to be here now with GB? Yeah, very special, uh, very proud to be here and the staff and the facilities here are first class. And um, dare I say it, I've got a very good record here, so I hope to be able to use my knowledge at this rink. Um, and the players are, are comfortable here also because we've been here in February, some of them have been here with the 20s, so it's a nice rink to play in. Uh, if we can get the, the British public out to support us, it creates a great atmosphere and it's, it's, it's really special. We're just ready to go and desperate to start playing now. You mentioned the 20s, but it goes back a bit before then that you had that tournament, the Ukraine tournament, the, a lot of the under-18s went in an under-20 tournament. Then, of course, there was here in, in Dumfries for the 20s. And now those same set of players, or a number of them, are here again. How important is that kind of continuity? Yeah, it's very important. I think when Pete was installed as the back-to-20s head coach, Pete and I spoke a lot and we continually speak daily about that progression and pathway through. And we picked a young team to, to go to the Sherapanov Cup. And then obviously Pete brought some guys here, so there has to be that steady stream of players coming for 18s to 20s and hopefully somewhere in the future to the senior team. And it will stand us in very good stead. We've got obviously Lewis Hook, um, who's our captain, who played a massive part for the 20s and he's going to be expected to play a massive part here again, um, along with other players. So it should stand us in good stead. They've got good tournament experience. And as I say, we're now we're just excited and, and the future of Great Britain Hockey is in good hands. What do you see in Lewis to, to make him your captain? I think Lewis, he's quiet, but he leads by example. Uh, he commands the respect to the players. He's been around, even at 17 years old, he's been around for what seems like a long, long time in Great Britain programme. This is his fourth tournament, if you, or fifth if you include the, the Sherapanov. So he's very, very experienced. And as I say, it's more that the leadership skills and the work rate and the respect that he has in the room. He just automatically commands that and ultimately he's going to be a huge player for us. And just finally, who have you named as his assistant captains and, and why? We've named uh, Ollie Bettridge and Ollie's a, a hard worker, again with a lot of experience and he's a lot more vocal. So he is uh, someone who will pump the guys up and again will still lead by example. And then we've named Sam Duggan, um, at 15 years old. I think Sam could be the future of this programme and this team and are definitely a future captain. And again, a guy who come in here with the 20s at, at, at 15 and absolutely worked his socks off. And again, commanded respect at that age group. So again, he's a, he's a young guy who's he's excitable. And I think he, he's going to typify what under-18 ice hockey is about. And I think again, as we say, we've got three good guys, three good leaders, three big, big players for us. And hopefully they'll lead by example and we'll, we'll achieve our goals. And just before we finish, one word about tonight. The Netherlands, as you mentioned, what can you expect from them? I think they'll be physical. I think they'll come out and they'll, they'll try and spoil us, spoil our style of game and they'll, they'll be physical and aggressive on us. We watched them a little bit yesterday, we're going to watch them again today because they'll skate after us. But I think the one thing we can say is we'll be ready, the boys are confident. So we'll, uh, we'll obviously do our homework but we'll, we'll let them worry about us more than we're going to worry about them and, and hopefully we'll start the tournament with a nice one. Okay, good luck tonight. Thank you very much, Chris. 
So there's the thoughts of the GB under-18s coach, Martin Grubb, ready for the tournament, of course, at the rink where he coaches the Solway Sharks. Behind me, the Dumfries Ice Bowl. So we're just about ready. If you can't get to the tournament, and do your best to get down if you're in the area and you can get down, ticket prices on the Ice Hockey UK website. That's www.icehockeyuk.co.uk. But if you can't get to the tournament, every game will be shown live. All 15 games will be live on Ice Hockey UK TV. The best way to find that is logging on to www.icehockeyuk.tv. Icehockeyuk.tv. I'll be joined in the commentary box by Jonathan Firmley and Ice Hockey UK's National Talent Development Officer, Mark Beggs. We'll be there. We'll all team up together to bring you all 15 games of the tournament. It's going to be a good one. GB are looking for gold. Anything could happen. There's a lot of teams, of course, who have come here looking for a medal, but the ultimate aim is promotion and GB going up to Division 1B. Stay in touch with us for the next few days. We'll bring you every little angle, every match highlight, every interview and feature throughout the next few days.